Hello everyone, it is Susan here, and today is day 11 of the 12 Days of Christmas Cheer collaboration with Poet Spice. So, tomorrow's the last day. I already have that video done. It's going to be a flip through of my December daily. Um, I have the first signature done. Today, I'm starting on the second signature. So, the videos are kind of out of order, but I wanted the flip, flip through to be on the 12th day. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> so, my... This is going to be my um, my second signature. And um, I have a bunch of papers here. I don't know that I'll use them all. Um, you know, I take stuff, pages out, add pages in, whatever, you know, the whole thing. But I have, I don't know, a good amount of pages here. And, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on this very first page right here. So I'm going to get rid of these other pages for right now. And what I want to do is I'll, I want to use a picture of my son. Um, so he, he's about six feet tall. He is, how old is he? 28 years old. He is in the autistic spectrum, but very high functioning. And oh my gosh, he, <laughs> two things with this picture. He just got his new glasses, so I want to capture those. And what he's holding here is an ice cream sandwich. And it is hysterical because it is teeny tiny. It's like half the size of, of a regular ice cream sandwich. And he didn't realize that when he bought it. And it was just so funny. We were just cracking up. So And so I snapped a, a picture of him. So I do know, I'm thinking I want to use this playing card. And I want to put that picture there. Now, I know I want to do that, so I'm just going to go ahead and, and do it. Now, so I use sometimes my HP Sprocket for my photos. And as you saw, it allows me to just um, pull the backing off and voila, easy peasy, no glue needed. I love it. <laughs> Easy peasy. Now, the next thing that I know I want to do is I do want to be able to write, well, what I just told you, but I also want to be able to, um, you know, see the playing card because I like it. I, you know, I don't want to hide it. I could pretty much hide the whole backing, but I think that defeats the purpose of it being a playing card. Right? So what I'm going to do is, I think I'll do it on here, um, is get down some adhesive and then I'm just going to cut off the end of it. And then this will allow me to, to keep the playing card there yet to write about, about the picture. Okay, so now I'm just going to cut this off. Okay, and I'll keep that because I might use that for something else. All right, so this piece is done. Easy peasy. I knew exactly what I wanted to do. And I was also thinking of doing a tip in here by using some washi tape and doing a tip in um, because I really wanted to place it on this piece of scrapbook paper. So all I do for a tip in, so a tip in is just literally that. It's something that tips. So like when you get a magazine and you know a page flips out, that's a tip in. That's all it is. So let me go ahead and and there's different ways to do a tip in and you know whatever whatever way works for you is awesome 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 
I don't know that it's going to be perfectly straight, but so I just want to grab the end or the edge right there and kind of go just like that. Good. So now what I want to do is I just want to put a little piece on the inside as well to hold it um, in there good enough. Right, so now, whoops, sorry, my fingers weren't working. So now I have my tip in, and now I get to document there, and I like that. Now, the next thing that I wanted to show you was this particular piece of scrap pa paper. It was um, a piece of packaging from something that I purchased. So I'm just kind of thinking out loud here. I want to wrap this around maybe a couple times. Okay, good. I'm going to make it a knot. Okay, so this is what I have so far. Now, on this piece of paper, or on this page, I do have some gold, um, gold gesso, which I had put on there a while back. It's dry. It's, it's not something I did recently. So I do know that I want this on the page. And again, I kind of liked the fact that there was black going on and everything. I, I like that. But I pulled out, <laughs> this is cute. It says, um, slay what? And I thought it was so perfect because he's like, kind of like, what? Like, what is it with this? ice cream sandwich and this is like slay what I just thought it was cute and I don't know that I would use that anywhere else so I might put that up there I might have to put some white paper under it and I also had this little like banner that says for you and I'm thinking about putting that there but I also wanted to pull in some fabric so I have I love all three of these and I thought that they would look really 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 good with this so there, there's a lot of um you know this is plaid that's plaid that's what buffalo check or close to it and that's just all that paisley going on it's like a lot of different patterns and everything but I really liked it so I thought that we could just kind of fool around for a minute here and see what we might be able to do I don't want to waste the fabric, you know, so I want to make sure that however it is I decide to use it, that you can see it. I don't want it hidden under, or not all the way hidden, you know, under something. So I was thinking of maybe, yeah, I just, like I said, I just want to make sure, sure that I can see it. So I do like that. One second, let me kind of get it there. I do like something like that, but then I'd have to put this down far enough if I'm going to put this up here. What do you think, guys? What do you think? I think what I'm going to do is I'm just gonna do this. I don't know, you know what? I make decisions and then figure it out after. So that's just, I. you know what? I think I like that better. So if I did something like that, but now I'm losing the majority of this. So let me go ahead and cut this in, not even quite half, less than half. Because like I said, I don't want it all hidden. What good is that? I mean, if I had like a tremendous amount of these fabrics, I wouldn't care. I do like that. I do like that. And then what I need to do is I need to find a white piece of paper. I'm just gonna use this pad right here. Doesn't have to be anything special. And I'm gonna put it on there. That's what I really need. All right, so let's get this stuff down. I'm just going to do it. Here we go. I'm using the fabric tack. I'm 
Okay, and I want to see that gold on the edge there. Do I have that the right way? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, that's good. And this piece will go here. But I do want to see the fabric. The, I like that fabric underneath, although I'm not going to see too much of it, but we will see it. All right, that's going to go there. And then this, gosh, I could even make that a, another tip in, but I won't. Let's just put, I'm going to just keep using a fabric tack. Okay, and let's get that down like that. Awesome. And all right, and then we'll get this down. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. Oops, oops, oops. I have to get this little string out of here. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to put a tissue over this to press that down to make sure that the fabric tack is adhering to the page. And if any oozes out, I'm good. It's not going all over me. All right, so I like that. So then the last thing, well, actually, these are the hearts that I took out. They're just like the perfect color because they're like this deep red and green. Um, I think I'm going to have to put them on here somewhere. You know what? I think I'm just going to put them up over here, staggered just a little bit like that. Perfect. And then here, right? So this is the tip-in. We have the tip-in. So I want to leave that. I could even put a, another picture here or more journaling. Um, but this, I think I'm just going to put it, I think just right there, right on the bottom. I like it there. Let's do it. So remember to check everybody's videos out below in my description box. And Jamie, uh, thank you so much for hosting this collaboration. One more day to go. One more day to go. Awesomeness. All right. So today is the day I'm doing this is what is today? Uh, well, this is going to be for the 11th. So I'm going to put the 11th. Now I want to mention to everybody, I have nothing for the 9th and the 10th of December, and I won't, and I'm fine with that. I don't need to have something for every single day. Where do I want this number? I guess I'll just put it right up here. Now, one thing I didn't do with this was I didn't edge anything with the ink, but you know what? I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it as is. So this is going to be the first page of my second signature. So next, what will happen is I'll work on this page. Well, maybe not in this order. Then I have a nice big page and, and so on and so forth. I'll have to do something here while, where I will have lace or something. I'll figure it all out. But for today, this is perfect. I got my son in my December daily and he hates getting photos of himself. He usually does not let me take a photo. I just want to say that. So this is like a miracle. <laughs> All right, um, if you'd like to see more videos like this, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and I will see you tomorrow. All right, God bless everybody. Bye-bye.